Happy Friday. I'm Morgan Ocker with your Concho Valley This Morning update. The mayor of a Concho Valley town is under indictment today in a debit card abuse case. A Coke County grand jury indicted Robert Lee Mayor Allison Crenshaw this month for an incident in September of 2018 where she is accused of fraudulently using a city of Robert Lee debit card. Officers arrested Crenshaw in March and she is out on bond. In April, city council members fired city secretary Crystal Blevins after she refused to resign from her position. Tom Green County residents hit by the storm early Saturday are getting help with cleanup this week. About half a dozen homes in major damage had major damage, including m lost roofs by the storm that included an EF2 tornado near the West Texas Boys Ranch early Saturday. People who live along Spring Creek Lane in West Tom Green County are still cleaning up the debris. Wall High School graduates received their diplomas at the Janelle Center in San Angelo Thursday evening. 81 seniors at Wall walked across the stage during last night's commencement exercises. They received their diplomas from school superintendent and board members. Hundreds of family members and friends of graduates attended and the 2019 Wall High School valedictorian is Samantha Stein. Members of the Wall High School band provided music for yesterday's ceremony. A new artwork exhibit featuring Concho Valley artists is now on display at the Gallery Verde Art Gallery. Gallery Verde is next to the Fine Arts Museum on South Oaks downtown. You can catch it today and Saturday from 10 to 6 and next Thursday and Friday from 10 to 6. You can see special artworks designed by residents at the State Supported Living Center in Carlsbad. The show is called Artfully Able and includes paintings, pottery and even handmade furniture. And now let's see what's happening in weather with Taban Sharifi. Taban, are we seeing storm chances today? We are seeing a very slight chance to see some isolated storms as we head towards the afternoon and evening. Today's high temperature, 87 degrees. Overall, though, mostly cloudy. And we are going to continue to see those warm and muggy and windy conditions gust to 35 miles per hour. Overnight tonight, continuing those rain chances, 70 degrees for your overnight low. And tomorrow will still be warm. Isolated chances remaining. Breezy winds as well.